Hello and welcome to coverage of the Lax Open 2021. My name is Tim Warwood. We did get a chance to sit down uh, with the athletes before any bibs were put on to chat about just how it is to be back competing in snowboard slope style. It's been so long since I did my last World Cup in slope style and it's been a lot of waiting to finally be back in the start gate, so I'm super excited. It feels good to be back together. Awesome to see all the guys riding and uh, everybody's happy to be on the mountain and just do what we love to do. Lox is definitely super important, especially being an Olympic qualifier. So yeah, it's definitely probably going to be the most important contest of the year. I am super happy to be back at Lox, especially to compete here. The course is always so good and they make the jump so perfect and it's actually one of the best courses I've ridden. We've got the men coming up for you very shortly, but first it's business time. Let's kick things off with the women. Jamie Anderson, she's won it four times. Can she win it five? She had a cracking semi-final run. I've been so inspired with the younger generation and watching the insane level of progression, but it also at times made me feel a little bit nervous, like if I still have it, but I've decided to just use all this new young energy to just rise with it and do my best and be inspired and also keep like leading my own path and doing things my own way. Qualifying in first place, Moritz Bob, the young lad from Davos just across the valley. Again, this is going to be his best result by far. For me, it's probably one of the first years where I kind of got like the skills I've been working on this summer to keep up with the riders, I guess. So this year was really important for me, especially because we're at home. I really like the course because it's just different. I mean, the first obstacle is kind of tough because there's so many lines you can take. So it's really unique. I've never seen a course like this, but it's just so flowy and fun. Today, it is all about the slope style finals. Here is your start list running in reverse order from what from which they qualified. And this is a really strong field, isn't it? Well, Anna Gasser then, first to drop here at the women's finals into the first of these features. Coming in switch, switch double. Yes, really nice. Little 180 into the soup spoon with the switch. Backside 180 out. Anagasa gets a decent score on the board. Right then, you're reigning champion. You're reigning Olympic champion. Namaste, Jamie Anderson. Switch double. It's a big trick now. What's she got? Just the front seven. Huge! Now, could she get clean this up with a grab on the 540 for more points? Yes, she has done it. An 84.35. Now, five times champion of the Lax Open. This morning when we got out here, it was so hard to see, just so flat and really scary. And as the day went on, we got some more contrast, which felt really good, but I don't even know what was going through my head. Go big, pop, grab, and smile. Thankfully, the wind died down for the second run, and I'm really happy that I could land a run. It's not my best run. I couldn't show my best snow running today, but I'm already excited for the next event, and I hope it goes better there. Here we go then, ladies and gents. Strap yourselves in. It's the men's finals at the Lax Open 2021. So now we see how the men will handle these conditions. Marcus Cleveland, just enjoy this, ladies and gents. This is snowboarding right here. Big double crippler. Backside one, two, three, four and a half, 16, 20. Really clean, really stylish run. So Nicholas Matson, the Swedish rider, currently leading, and here he goes. 
So let's just see how he handles this. Nice little front board transition. And then, yeah, really nice and tech. Now, Matson with a switch, double. And cranking out the 16. What a run. Oh, and then the backside rodeo out of the ladle. Goodness me. Nicholas Matson of Sweden takes the win here and becomes your Lax Open 2021 Snowboard Slope Star Champion. It's been a tough love with Lux Open before. I know it's six or seven years. I never qualified, never put down my runs, but this year to come here and put down run after run and then end up on the top of the podium feels like a dream. It's going to be more fun to come back next year. Definitely the nerves were hitting when I was dropping for my first run and I just wanted to put one down to make sure everything was good and unfortunately went down on Switchback 12 on my second run, but I'm just happy. I definitely exceeded my expectations. Ended up third place, which I'm really hyped about. First um, podium since my accident, so uh, yeah, couldn't be better. Super happy. It's a really good feeling just to be back on the podium, uh, just to know that I have the tricks that I need to, to get up there and uh, also to keep my nerves calm when everything's going on. So yeah, feels good to be back for sure.